So what are we entering? The Lower Sackville Wellness Center. My name is Steve Oliver. I was a computer technology consultant. I am the owner director of the Lower Sackville Wellness Center. It is very cool. It's very cool. The Lower Sackville Wellness Center is in the early stages of uh, opening to the public. We've gone through all the business preparation, uh, building business plans, getting funding, doing leaseholds, and now we're just this week opening the doors. Uh, well, this is uh, Wednesday, so we've got Thursday, Friday, three days away for the grand opening. I think the panicking ha happened uh, last week. Uh, you know, um, everyone that's been coming by has really enjoyed the place. and. Uh, starting to relax a bit more. Even the guy putting the sign up today, he got it. He, he was, you know, he said, well, I used to do transcendental meditation, and maybe I'll come back and try it. I, I think the hardest part, uh, the beginning stage of opening a new business uh, for me, was having the mental uh, willingness to let it be big, rather than uh, thinking that be safe and think small, I decided to take the risk and think big. This is uh, my consultation room. And uh, I may or may not put a table in here, I don't know. There's a lot of rooms for tables you'll see upstairs. Uh, this is a fully functional kitchen. These two rooms here are for lease. Storage room. I like this room. Yep. It's this nice. I like the color. Uh, uh, we're start with two rooms. And the other table is coming in either today or tomorrow. But this room will be set up. It's a nice room. It is. Yeah. And the colors are very relaxed. Very right. good. Uh, this area will be for uh, a library. Yoga, Tai Chi, uh, seminars, uh, whatever. Right. Parties. <laughs> this is it. This is home. Oh yeah. This wellness center is simple. Easy to do stuff to make you feel good and to get you on a path where you feel good for not just a little bit but for a long time. Well, this month it is really getting all our procedures together, getting our classes organized. Well, it all makes you nervous. I mean, there isn't anything that doesn't you know, generate anxiety. Uh, the most stressful part is uh, trying to communicate out to the public what it is we're about. The most fun part is seeing the people that have come in and that have expressed a gratitude and interest in seeing a facility like this. You know, if we're not making a profit in the next two or three months, that's not going to be uh, what I'm going to measure. I'm going to measure the numbers of people and, and the amount of involvement. And based on that, I can then start making good assumptions about, you know, do we have a growth mode here? Uh, and so I want to generate growth. I have to put aside all of the potential problems and look at all the potential upsides and try to work towards those. Uh, you know, I really won't know for another um, month or two how we're doing. And, and in a sense too, the opening, the, you know, it, it will be a dedication. I dedicate the center to my mother. Dr. Perlene Oliver, who has spent her life uh, helping and, and promoting um, community and personal development. Here's a picture of my mother with my daughter Lauren when she was younger. And she gives me the, uh, when I sort of wake up in the morning and figure out how am I going to do this, I say, well, how would mom do it? <laughs>